And welcome back in, guys, to episode six of this Hydrograph playthrough with, excuse me, myself, Jono, and our protagonist here, Dick Fondelson. Thanks for being with us. Um, we have had a good old rummage through this place um, and next door, but there's a lot more rummaging to do. But in essence, we've found a lot of basic essential shit that we need. Not only did we find a lumber saw, we found a regular old saw. We found a screwdriver hiding in a little toolkit. We found a load of little fucking piddly things, which I remember being useful. But who knows? <coughs> These kind of things, where you'll end up looking for them for two months and you can't fucking find them. Um, we have some chisel bits, you know, heads to go on screwdrivers. We found an electric multi screwdriver thing, electric multi tool, which I remember we need for a lot of carpentry shit. Um, I can't remember which battery goes in it, I'm guessing it's a 9 volt one. Um, but big news, we found an auger, and we also found mining machine, I think we have that already, metal detector, we've put a battery in there, we found a sledgehammer, so we found a load of old shit here, mason, trowel, we found a shotgun, we found a nice little shotgun as well, okay, we have enough clay I believe to make a kiln, although I don't think we've read the pottery book, but we have enough shotgun shells, and we have a shotgun, so we can cause a little bit of, you know, mischief, if we want to, and we do want to. Um, we have a load of lumber, I believe carpentry has gone up to level 4, so we could do with finding the next book. And that was just with a bit of dismantling crates and shit, we didn't, we didn't go all out. But the weather is clear, so we're going to start to ferry some of this stuff back home. Food is a problem guys. We are very hungry and we are completely out of food. So we need to ferry some of this stuff home and I'm wondering whether we use the dolly to do it. In here we have a number of other bits and pieces, pickaxe, multi-head drill bit and all this shit. So we found about four axes, three of them are in really good nick, one of them needs reparations, alright. So a really good haul screwdriver, a couple of hedge trimmers, it's all good brother and um, we're going to start to ferry this back and forth to the place and if we get into trouble I will bring you back in. Okay so we're back at the house, we're back at the farm here, we've dropped the dolly off the axe, some nails just to create a bit of um, space, they seem to like the chicken coop as I'd previously guessed um, and they are malingering, they're loitering here Malingering is the wrong word. That's what people do in the hospital. This is not that. So we're going to make use of these stakes. And I forget that we're fucking half deaf. I'm not used to it. Hmm. It's got a weak jaw stab. We did get a skill increase, I think it was in sprinting. Okay. Some food would be lovely. Nope. No such courtesy from these wankers. From this riffraff. Hmm. So, it's going to be time for bed. The only food we have left in the cupboards, apart from tree bark, um, is some peanut butter. So tomorrow we're going to have to go out and get some food. We can get some books, try and pick up pottery or something, that would be a bonus too. have to make a decision on whether we go for something big like um, the bookstore and restaurants or whether we just target houses and hope that we get lucky it might be safer to do the houses you know oh, we already had pliers okay we've already got a few bits look mason trowel bits that I'd forgotten about um, ooh, ammunition <sighs> 
yeah. Yeah. We've got more seeds to add to that pile. Whether we can actually use any of them right now, I'm not too sure. But, oh man, we're going to have to eat the fucking peanut butter. My plan of gaining weight. Oh. Did we get rid of underweight? Maybe we did. Wow. How the hell have we done that? Because literally, um, guys, we, we've been starved forever, you know? So I have no idea how that is possible. Um, but anyway, we're in trouble with food. Um, yeah. Um, I don't want to eat anything rotten because we took the, the sort of the trait where we get upset and ill if we do that. Uh, we killed this lady earlier. Glass beaker, hey, and a calculator. Very nice. Um, so we're going to sleep. We're going to sleep, and I'll um, sort out some of the stuff, some of the loot, and I'll bring you back in in the morning. All right, cheers, guys. And I reckon we have about maybe one third, if not one half, of the shit um, lugged back here. A uh, little bit dicey, taking this, you know, hand trolley thing around and effectively not being able to um, fight the zombies, you know. Um, right now, what we need to do... is fight zombies, always. Um, but we need food, so if these piss ants are not going to give us any, then, you know, we need to go out and find it. <clears throat> um, so, what we're going to be doing is going down south, uh, back to the house. At least we have a fighting chance now. Don't want to get knackered. Don't want to get too knackered to work our way through all these toss pots. There we go there. Yeah, I know. Should probably save this, you know, for Slight panic. Yeah, I know, I know. Tell me about it, right? Yeah, I should probably save that, really. Yes, yes. But the fact that we can make it out of, um, you know, sticks is pretty cool. You know, I quite like that. Down to our last one. Okay, so maybe we ought to switch back over to the old axe. Um, you know, at some point what we'll do is we'll, we'll clear this a bit. If we are going to remain at the farm, we will um, clear these trees. We'll have to cut them down a bit because although there's a kind of a pathway through, like, it's obscured by the six months later. You know, there's shit growing in the way. <clears throat> We have to be a little bit careful down here. Good news is I'm drinking tea, so, you know, the chances of us dying are not, you know, not as much. They're lessened. Whew. And, I mean, really, you don't need to see this. My fucking, my worry, my concern is that being a Hydrocraft playthrough, I'm worried that this is going to take... You know, it has the potential to span over 150 episodes or more. And I don't want to do that. So I'm not going to be documenting every second of this. You know, I will be bringing you guys back in. Um, so what we're going to do is I'm going to fight our way down here to, you know, civilization. Um, and when we get to the houses, um, I think I'll bring you back in because... 
you know, that's the point at which um, it gets a little bit more exciting in terms of, you know, we might actually find something. Oh yes, and before I forget, we have skill increase. So sprinting, hurry, sprinting gets a boost. Four behind, but, you know, we are, we are not near to uh, completing anything except from foraging, which will be exciting. Okay, right, I will cut you back in when we get to this house. God damn it. Okay, okay. <clears throat> we have double checked the two houses that we've already looted. I don't know why. We've just got a zombie here and they've dropped us an MRE, so that's going to keep us going, which is great because we're going to have to head back soon. It's getting dark. Ah, oh, butter knife as well. That's sweet. Um, yeah, we're going to have to get back soon. Uh, we picked up pepper, carrot seeds, just some trivial stuff. Um, hopefully, hopefully we can get into this house here. I mean, I'm. I don't know how much stuff is going to be in there. Okay. Earbuds and a dollar. Now, season five, I collected a load of stuff that I probably didn't need to. I don't know. I melted down a load of gold. I made gold bars and everything like that. And I just couldn't really use them, I guess. If, um, -hee -hee -hee. no, 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 you bloody bastard. Ah, oh, yes, please. Um, yeah, I guess for some of the high end stuff, maybe you need it, but I didn't really need it. I was quite content making ammunition, and I would be again, really. Oh, what are you doing, Dick? It's getting late, mate. You're tired, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, once we get some food... Oh dear. Then, um... I'll expert calligraphy, advanced cooking, okay. Hmm. We are going to need all these books at some point. But I'm not going to worry about picking them up just now. We just want food. There we go, that's lovely. Okay, chocolate and cereal. Yes, please. Salami. Wicked. Oh, man. Another butter knife. A kitchen knife. That'll do us. Red wine. Thank God. Orange jello. Fuck it. Yeah, whatever. Chocolate. I uh, would even probably even eat the cat food. I'm pretty sure we have a can opener, but we're going to take another one just in case. This is good. This is very good. Okay, chopping, cutting board. I don't know if we need that. Okay. Um, there is an upstairs to this place. Oh, rotten, rotten. Eat that. Mm-hmm. Eat a packet of crisps. Put on some weight, buddy boy. Get rid of that. Um, we could do with another bag. What else could we do with? We could do without that we could do without that. But what we could do with... Empty pill box. I swear we need that later on. I did start to think about making tutorials. I'm not really qualified. But what I did do is I kind of put together... Is that it? Bloody hell. I suppose it's all you need. It's functional, right? Yeah, what I did do is I put together... Um, or started to put together like a list of um, like weird items that you might just brush by in this um, you know with this mod and think you know what the fuck is that I don't need that when you know later on you could be spending a long long time trying to find it steel pulley multi-tool saw we have a multi-tool so no 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 no, 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 dear girl. It's absolutely a nitty no no there. Okay, so this is going to keep us going for a little bit. Um, it's dark, so I'm not comfortable being here. We need to get home. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to get back to the farm. And from there, um, we may look to do another trip out to McCoy to bring some more stuff back. Um, and we'll start to cook on gas, I think. 
Um, we don't want to stay at the farm, it's not a permanent residence, but you know, for the time being, uh, he quite likes it, so we'll give him the benefit. All right, okay, I'll cut you back in. And again, before I forget, um, folks, we had another skill increase, blade accuracy, so we're definitely sticking that down in there. Um, that's going to help quite a bit. Um, we have four axes, so we're going to be making jolly good use of them. All right, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, guys, we're back at the house. Most of the stuff is stashed away. We have got four books that we've recovered from corpses or that we have stolen from houses, and I'm going to open these now uh, with you with me because remove book cover. I am hoping for flower field guide to complete the set or I'm hoping for the pottery textbook. That's a big hope because there's lots of books but let's see how we get on. Oh bird field guide close okay gunsmithing nope two fungi field guides bird field guide interesting hmm eggs. Well, you, oh, now that is, that is a lucky, lucky, lucky little dippy dip. Um, I'm just thinking the bird field guide, have they added this? You know, the get, uh, mods evolving, so maybe the bird field guide is added as a fourth guide, you never know. But the anarchist cookbook, that is unexpected. Add private notes. Detonator capsule, claw gas grenade, blimey, okay. Thermite bomb, improved gas mask, wowee. Okay, what else did we get? Soap making, well, we haven't read it yet, so what's the harm, hey? That's cool, I like that. Okay, so that's where we are. So. I'm going to go out and do some foraging to get tired um, and then in the morning we're going to take this dolly and we are going to go back up I'll probably kill zombies on the way and then on the way back we won't um, and recover some more bits and pieces now let's check on these shall we seedling broccoli okay well watered flourishing well that's good news I thought they would die but hey ho we've got some potatoes that we could potentially plant yeah okay that's what's going on all right I'll cut you back in cheers and on our way to do another run with a dolly this is what's happening I suppose it's better that it happens now than in our sleep but god damn I didn't want this to happen like this Uh, it's not very good even with the deaf half deaf trait it's still pretty menacing and loud it kind of heralds the end of all things so once we get on this road we are just gonna run up and away from the city I'm just going to wait this thing out. I'm going to put the dolly down here. Where is it? There we go. We don't need that. Whew. Hmm. Yes, it's not good. Not good at all. And what I worry about is that we're just going to create such a train of assholes that it's going to become very difficult to get back. Oh. I had to risk that. 
<laughs> that was lucky given the context of things and us being short of food or relatively short of food dog tags I can't remember I think I used to pick those up with the you know intention of melting them down at a later time I can't remember what's up here if anything I don't think there's anything particularly exciting up here the excitement's going to come from the hundreds of millions of wankers stalking us road flare very appropriate eh? Uh, yes a good little good little bunch we have following us here reprobates Let's say if I can pick them off then I will if it's a freebie behind this kitchen knife I think we have two butter knives so not a great deal to work with no 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 that was ill conceived it was a bottle job basically okay right that's the kitchen knife gone then I don't think we taken any more skill increases. Sneaking will be there at some point. Foraging too, which is nice. Um, could do with the foraging book, but you know it's going to get leveled up anyway. It's a really important skill in Hydrocraft. Uh, we have the metal detector, but I don't think I'm going to even bother attempting to use that, you know. until um, until we get that foraging skill up nice and high um, this is a ruse because I know that that helicopter is coming back at some point it will probably come and go two or three times um, right in the interest of saving disk space <sighs> and cutting it down I'm gonna cut you back in when it shows up again and no sign of that helicopter I'm just making our way back on the corpses we've had two books um, so we're gonna remove the covers now and we had a better find as well uh, which is a normal hiking bag so same weight reduction as the messenger bag uh, but the capacity is a lot bigger so Ooh, plumbing, we've read that one. Auto... Dismantle auto parts. Okay, that's cool. That's very cool. Do we want to take that with us? I don't know. I mean, I guess we can afford to now. So the messenger bag, we're going to unequip it. Uh, I'm going to put it in secondary. Normal hiking bag's gonna go on our back. And then we need to like think about Alice packs and dogs and all the rest of it, but I mean, you know, right now at the start of the game, we're just trying to fucking survive. That's all we're trying to do. Okay, cool. Dun 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 kind of I'm gonna miss this functional little man bag because you know we were in desperate need of that bag and we, we found that one fair and square but it's gone now and in the absence of any more helicopters we're just gonna make our way nice red dot and laser okay that's good we do have some ammunition wormsy yeah because I can't remember if we can trap birds in the winter. If we can trap birds, then our food problem is gone. It's done. Um, because I can't remember if I read the correct hunting magazine. Shall we take a quick look? Sorry to bore you with this. Um, where's Trapper? 
make wooden cage, make stick trap, that is it, that's the trap for birds, right? I'm pretty sure, so make a stick trap, we can do that, there is, and um, we can bait it with worms, so I think we're sorted, I think we're sorted, I don't think we have to worry about food anymore, and once we get past this initial hurdle, it's, you know, fucking jobs are good in time, I may need to pour myself a gin, <laughs> All those dickheads that were following us have just disappeared into the trees. Which is great news. So Dick's having a bit of luck here. Stroke of luck, eh, Richard? That's right, mate. Count your blessings, you penis. <laughs> I was going to call him a bald bastard, but, you know, uh, my hair's receding too, so we'll, we'll go easy on that one. <laughs> okay. In the absence of any more helicopter, we will shuttle some goodies from the lumber mill back to the yard. And I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. If I come back in in a minute, you'll know that the helicopter has returned. Um, but if I don't, then I'll see you in a couple of days, where we'll start to do some uh, set up some hunting, you know, some some birdie traps and um, you know this that and the other I think we may have missed the the turning turning the little junction to get up to the um, lumber mill I think it could be here yes it's just kind of um, overgrown so this was real real nervous shit um, when we were in a blizzard that was not the best time to be traveling but I kind of felt like our life depended on it, so yeah, there we go. All right, nice one, guys. Catch you later in a bit, seas. Oh no, 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 you don't, you bloody bastard. Do her, dick. She's a tough nut as well. Give her some matches, thank you very much. And here comes her mate. Ah, uh, yeah, the screwdriver reserved for special occasions because until we find another one we're not letting it break. Alright guys, <laughs> like I say, in a bit.